Come on, hey. Welcome back to my channel. I haven't vlogged in a really long time. Um, other stuff I've been posting and stuff I previously recorded or had obligations to do stuff. So, but this is like my first time just creating content just for the hell of it. I just been going through some stuff, and I will say this. God is like always on the throne. I'm not like an uber religious person or anything, but I will say that. And just to say, I'm here, I'm alive, in spite of what I got going on, I'm blessed. So, nevertheless, I'm headed to the grocery store. I picked my son up from school today, and um, he was like, he wants a subway. He wanted me by himself a subway, and I'm just like, better time by you a sub, brother sub. Like, by the time I buy all these subs, I'm gonna spend some money, and I'm just like, I ain't got time for that. And so, I was like, I'll just make some subs. And he was like, You can't make a me bow sub. What you mean I can't make a me bow sub? Like, like, I can make whatever any of these restaurants make, I can make it. And I've never made a me bow sub. So I guess maybe that's why he's saying we never had that as a meal, like, at the house that I cook. So, <clears throat> so that's, that's how I'm on a mission today to make some me bow subs to show this guy, this little boy, that his, I can make a meatball sub. So, um, I guess I've never made one at home. And a good meatball sub, um, uh, is like amazing. Like, I used to work in Linens. That was like my first, well, that was like my second job upon graduating high school. And that was many, many moves though. So I don't know if you got a Linens where you at, but it's like a subway. And they had like, you know, delis and philly and they also have meatball sub and for what i remember when i used to make those meatball subs because you know when you're making stuff yourself when you work at restaurant this should always be like extra and fire so it is i can remember like the oregano and the um that parmesan cheese meat on the meatball subs and it was like really really good so i'm gonna try to do that and um ace was like well, you're not going to be able to find the bread. And I'm like, yo, I didn't get some hokey rolls. Like, what are you talking about? He's really thinking, like, I can't do this. So, I am going to go and get some meatballs, some sauce, some rolls, some good cheese. Because I know cheese is always makes your food. And this is going to be my dinner for today. I didn't go to work today. Um... I don't know. I just been on in the world. I've been sick. I, you, if you can hear it, it's still like it's in my house. And it's like it's something going on because it's a lot of people that's been like sick. It's like I was sick. I had a cold. Like I thought I took Hailey Bug to Chuck E. Cheese. And while I was at Chuck E. Cheese, I had a fucking headache. But it was her birthday. And I was just like, you just gotta, you know, when you've grown, you can't, you gotta do what you gotta do. That's part of being an adult, a parent. So. Even though I wasn't feeling my best, if I wasn't the best, I did to go to Chuck E. Cheese and just kind of push myself what I did. And like the next day, I just immediately felt like bad. And I, you know, I felt like I had a cold. And this was like two weeks ago. And I'm still dealing with this cough. And I always, I will say, every time I, I do get like a cold or anything, I have like a cough for weeks. And it'd be like this dry cough. And it'd be like, I know I went to the nail shop the other day. They had me a mask on, so I went to the nail shop. And I was waiting to get my nails polished. And this, it was like, and it's crazy, it was just me and one other lady. I'm just sitting here. And then, like, the, like, I knew the longer I sit in there, no fruits was gonna get to me. It was gonna get tickled, like, get to my throat. And it, it did. And it just set me off. And I was like, hold on, let me just give you the money <coughs> so I can go. Cause I don't be here hacking and coughing. People think I got the cooties and shit. And I was like, I'm finna go. But the man was like, he stopped what he was doing and came and polished my nails. I was like, I need some water. Like, I need to go outside. I need to go outside. I need to get some air. And I always have to, like, step out of where I'm at because I get this cough. And it's really, like, I can't stop it. 
Because I always try to keep me like a bottle of water with me. And just to see, like, I'm going to go in here and find me some cough drops. I know this lady work. She gave me some cough drops the other day. <laughs> I guess I was coughing too much for her taste. Can they, they, it helped me. And she gave me some Alka-Seltzer so plus. They really didn't do shit for me. But, um, so me and Haley Buckford going to Kroger and get this stuff so we can get back and make this meal. And, um, I'll be back. Trying to find meatballs. I got turkey meatballs. Angus beef. What is this regular beef? These are corn style meatballs. So, turkey. Um, I don't know because I do eat a lot of turkey meat. I don't know. Are they going to taste the same? So. I think I'm gonna just roll with the the home style meatballs. That's the one bag with it. Okay. Looks like they owls are not really filled with this. So I'm trying to find some cough drops. I can't think of what they were. These are house. And sometimes, like the store brand, just be just as good as the um, it's the name brands, you know. So I don't want to spend a whole bunch of money on some cop shops. So I'm gonna get those and let's see. Okay, so the reason the owls are so empty, they got a recall on like the rubber tussin. Okay, so maybe that's why they don't have a whole lot of stuff on these, this cold owl because they got a recall. But I was trying to find like some, um, like some, because rubber tussin, I don't know, that's what we grew up with, rubber tussin back in the day. But they got all this other stuff, the steak quill. And that stuff for like the honey in my opinion don't be that great. So let's see. And that's allergy medicine down there. So um I don't know what I'm gonna get because I just don't wanna get anything. So they got night quill and they have day quill. So I'm just gonna try the the day quill. Hold on so this program. Floor okay, so I just got the meatballs out the oven. I'm gonna put them in this sauce. I get I put a little seasoning in it. I didn't put much because, like, I didn't make it like I would make my spaghetti sauce. I just kind of just gonna let it be kind of how it is out the jar. So I'm gonna put this in. Then I'm gonna throw my fries in this grease, and then once everything comes out, I will show you guys. I'm trying to enjoy my food, but hey, I just want to eat is the, the tomatoes. So, it's pretty good. I think the next time I will make my own um, meatballs. Because the meatballs are really bland. The sauce came out pretty good. I didn't have any oregano. I thought I did. I had no oregano. I didn't have no Italian seasoning. But I was able to like kind of dope it up, the sauce up. And then I um, put it the buns in the oven to make it look crispy. I don't know why we so soggy. But like I said, The um meatballs themselves are bland. So yeah. 
But it was a quick meal. And I can't. I don't know what it. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what they receipt it. I'm gonna look at the receipt and see how much I spent. <coughs> because I spent like a total. I was trying to stay on a hundred dollars, but I spent like a hundred and twenty. But it was what? Let me get other stuff. So I'm still thinking. Can we buy this for like I think? I'm gonna say about ten dollars for that bag. Cheese, say three. Bones for so it's like seventeen. And a sauce. So it probably was about twenty, twenty five dollars, give or take. I'm sorry, twenty five. Just for the ingredients. And we know there ain't no five dollar foot long subs no more. So I'm trying to see if, if I would have got everybody a sub. I think they like seven dollars now. They might have I don't think they like six. They like five and some change. So let's say six times four to it might have it might have been about the same price, to be honest with you. It might have been a tight. But it is cheaper because I feel like half the bag of meatballs. I was small meatball. Just a party night for party meatball. And this is why I said I would probably do like make my own meatballs so it can be like actually like three nice ass meatballs. But it's enough to make like two more sandwiches in there. And plus I still got half a bag of meatballs. So I can probably make another meal with the meatballs so yeah it's cheaper it's cheaper too like it definitely came out cheaper and you can put as much stuff on there as you want so it's always good to cook at home i like to eat at home i, I don't mind cooking because i like <coughs> food with flavor i like to eat and then i like my food to taste good so just eating out sometimes you get like Stuff is like really bland. Or people like they cater and they like bring food because they cater and it should be like bland as fuck. But I guess you gotta do that because people have like, you know, high blood pressure so you can't make stuff really salty and stuff. Yeah. It's for the, you know, caterers out there. Oh, that's too long food. I can have this season. So I'm gonna finish this up. I got me some um little margarita mix from the store. And it's Monday. I gotta go to work tomorrow. I took the day off because I had intended on taking my mom to the doctor today, but she didn't end up going. So I've been trying to like I tried to rest. Got like an hour nap. I've been doing some cleaning and stuff, so I gotta. I move. I, I have cleaned up a lot of stuff, and I'm just in the season of my life <coughs> where I'm just trying to get rid of anything that's not serving me no purpose. So I got a lot of stuff. I got the kids to take out down to the curb because today is trash day. And then I am. Um, I'm supposed to have somebody to come do some work on my house, but they didn't even call them. They was coming today. They just showed up. And then they showed up, left, and had, still ain't called me. So they called me tomorrow. I'm talking about, oh, I was there trying to do some work. Nah, I just ain't gonna take your phone call because it's unprofessional and I don't know. I don't have time for it. And so I just, I like, I'm, my mindset. It's like I gotta be productive. Like I gotta be doing something. So if I'm not at work, I need to be doing something to like bring some productivity to productivity to my life. So just sitting at home. I don't see how people do that. 
They're sitting at home all day. I don't want them. If I can be no stay at home wife, because I'll be like, I need to have me a, a at home job. <laughs> be like door dashing or something because I like to be productive. I like to be self sufficient. I like to be productive. I say productive with my time. I don't like being unproductive. I don't like unproductive people. So, yeah. And that's probably why I do this YouTube stuff because I'm 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 always doing stuff. I promise you, I'm always my sister. Like when we go on vacation, she be like, "Why are you doing this? Why are you going there?" Like she like to rest. I like to I like to do stuff. Like I'm on vacation because I want I want to go see stuff. If I want to sleep, I stay home. So this is me. So I'm gonna get a like I said, it's seven twenty three now. So I'm gonna finish eating. Get myself ready for work tomorrow and ready to get ready for the rest of the week because I still got some things to do. I got a, um, some appointments I got to get to and the kids are winding down with school. So they're supposed to be getting out early. So I got to make sure um, baby boy Ryan knows that he's getting out earlier. So it's a lot I got to do, but I did want to vlog and I haven't vlogged in a long time. So I'm going to get back into it. I'm going to get back into some of the things. And so, yeah, I got some things coming up that I do want to record. And hopefully I will be posting some stuff within this next couple of weeks that I have already recorded. So, until next time, you guys. Thank you.